Hi, my name is Jackie and I'm a third year civil engineering student from the class of 2017. And today we're going to be learning how to record the correct number of sig figs on glassware. The general rule of thumb for reading significant figures on glassware is to figure out the smallest increment that the glassware displays and then read the volume with an additional one-tenth of the increment accuracy that was given. For example, look at this graduated cylinder. The lines are in increments of 0.1 milliliters. This means that when we read the volume of the liquid, we read it to the hundredths place because that is an additional one-tenth of the given increment. Let's take a closer look at some examples. Our first example is a 10 milliliter graduated cylinder. After filling the graduated cylinder with a solution, we will take the reading. Remember how to correctly take your measurements. Make sure not to look above or below the meniscus, but at eye level. Make sure that you read the bottom of the meniscus when taking the measurement. In the case of this graduated cylinder, the increments are by 0.1 milliliters, which means that we will be recording volume to the hundredths place. In this case, the volume of the liquid appears to be 7.11 milliliters. The next glassware instrument we will look at is the 50 milliliter barrette. Looking at this instrument, the increment also appears to be 0.1 milliliters, which means the measurement taken should be to the hundredths place. Therefore, we say the volume of the liquid is 35.10 milliliters. Finally, we are looking at the 10 milliliter glass pipette. This instrument has the same increments as the previous two, so therefore it should be measured with the same accuracy. The volume of the liquid is 4.29 milliliters.